This film is all about the Steeple Foundation and the great work it does for all kinds of charities. We have a lot of fun and create loads of smiles when we raise money. It's all about teamwork and using your heart to think of others. It's absolutely brilliant, uh, you know, I mean, I absolutely love it from day one, you know, when, when we started the Steeble Foundation in 2010, you know, I mean, uh, we haven't looked back, you know, we've looked forward and uh, raising over, I think it's half a million pounds up to date is absolutely brilliant. The Steeble Foundation provides charitable support in the form of grants to organisations primarily in the Black Country and the West Midlands, which specialise in assisting young people, the disabled, the homeless, the sick and the disadvantaged. Promise Dreams uh, is primarily set up to realise the dreams of seriously and terminally ill children and it's our job just to make sure they have a special memory or something special that them or the family need um, to help make a smile and create smiles for them. We're really proud that uh, first and foremost Steve Ball is our patron, has been since the beginning of Promise Dreams and in many ways has uh, always supported everything we've done with whatever he can do. Promise Dreams is extremely lucky to have received a considerable amount of money from the Foundation since uh, they started, which has gone on to make dreams come true. Lee is 13 and living with Duchenne muscular dystrophy. This is a muscle wasting disease which gradually worsens. Lee is already wheelchair dependent and is very aware that sadly he is unlikely to live to see his 30s. Lee loves watching wrestling matches and his mum got in touch with us to ask whether we could help deliver his dream of watching Wrestlemania live in California before he came too weak to manage the trip. I'm really pleased to say that the Foundation have been able to make this dream come true. To be fair, it, it, it came to my heart with my mum and dad uh, because my mum and dad used to have the blood taken and stuff like that and they come back with bruises on their arms and uh, I thought that you can't keep doing this, you can't keep doing this. Russell's all came up to us and said, uh, you mean, we, we found this, uh, this new technology, this vein finder, to find any veins in young children, to older people, we can find veins straight away. And I thought, well, go on and go over there and do it. And we delivered the vein finder for them. I mean, there's people coming out there now with just one, band, one little plaster on rather than five or six on their arms, you know what I mean? So it's, it's absolutely brilliant. It's, it's things like this that, that the Steeble Foundation like doing. My name's Jason Levy. I'm fundraising director for Midlands Air Ambulance Charity. We run three aircraft that run the emergency services across the six counties of the Midlands. But we were fortunate enough to be selected by Steve Ball and his foundation, and without support of foundations like Steve Ball, we simply wouldn't exist. And each mission will cost over £2,000 to attend. The money from the Steve Ball Foundation will go straight into using it, those, those processes. My name's Neil Taylor from Birmingham Children's Hospital. Been an ambassador there for six months now. Every single penny that's raised by Steve, it's, it makes a difference. It does make a difference. It's easy saying that, but it does. And whether it's a piece of equipment that's worth forty thousand pound, or it's a, a laptop on the wards to help the, the children stay in hospital be as easy as it can. Like you say, the energy he's got for the charity is absolutely unbelievable and his inspiration to uh, like people like myself who, who uh, you know, go on and help, help the fundraising. I would like to say a big thank you again for Steve supporting Birmingham Children's Hospital. We run a creativity and innovation module with our students and we wanted our students not just to talk about it but to actually do it and so in the second half of their module we came up with an idea that they should create a, a fundraising idea for various charities and raise money for those charities and we were aware of the uh, foundation and what they did in terms of distributing money to other charities so we realised that working with the foundation we could reach out into the different communities in Wolverhampton without getting involved with multiple charities at that time. When you talk about Steve, the students immediately think of football, so they do lots of kind of fundraising events around football. But we have a, a real kind of wide variety of things, you know, we have casino evenings, we have, we've had wacky races, we've had uh, sumo wrestling in rubber suits. The Tour de Marstons, which was a 50 mile bike ride, starting and finishing at the Marstons Brewery. And Steve decided he was fit enough to do that. 
and found out that having not been on a bike for a long time, 50 miles is a very long way. And although he suffered, he finished and he, he made it to that finishing line. You could see his determination coming through. One of the things that the foundation is particularly good at is supporting students through the events. And that's not just when the events are taking place, but helping the students and challenging the students when they're developing those ideas. The way that Kirsty and Jack have supported the students has been excellent. They meet the students on a regular basis every week or every two weeks. They advise and guide them and coach them through the process. Uh, and it's great when you can see the funds then coming into the charity at the end of the day. The Steeple Foundation has been fantastic to uh, support us over the last few years and have helped us to purchase um, vital equipment to help us uh, with patient care here at Compton Hospice. They have provided um, support for us for uh, some laptops when a, uh, a nurse goes in to see a patient and wants to take notes. Uh, instead of using paper, they can put these notes straight onto laptop computers and make it very easy for us. Uh, they've also uh, bought some uh, blood pressure machines, which again are fantastic to use for the patients and help us with the day-to-day -day care. It means that we can offer the best possible care to our patients who um, are terminally ill and the support and these facilities are absolutely vital and without the Steeple Foundation we wouldn't be able to, uh, to access these facilities that we need so uh, it's, it's great, it's fantastic, thank you. Well I'm, I'm very fortunate, you know I mean I've had, a, I've had a great career in football, you know I mean after now I'm lucky enough to, 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 to raise awareness in the, in the community with, with charities, you know I mean I'm, I've been with Compton Hospice, Thomas Dreams, children, families, it's, I'm a very fortunate person, I'm a very fortunate person to do this and uh, I'm, I'm standing here now, I can do it and I'll carry on doing it as long as I can but I need, I need the people's help out there. Well I've got the biggest smile here, you know it's one of those, you know I mean if I can go into a place and shake hands and greet people with a big smile on my faces, that's absolutely brilliant, but I like to see it coming back as well. You know, I like it when I take these things to hospitals or offices or, as I say, these children's uh, families. I love seeing their faces as well. The Steedball Foundation has raised over half a million pounds up to date. We'd like to double that again as quickly and as soon as possible. We need your help. You know what I mean? We can all sit here, eat, drink, sleep, do what we do, but there's hospices, there's, there's charities, there's organisations out there that need your help. You know what I mean? Get your hands in your pockets, get your money out, because you can do it. There's lots of people out there who need a helping hand. Let's get together and help them smile. To get involved and raise money for some brilliant charities, please look at our website, thesteveforfoundation.co.uk.